The most challenging part was the kick, like the kick starting of it, like going there. I just booked a flight and went there on my own. I don't have relatives or family there. So that was the toughest part. But once you get there, everything just moves on and gets easier. I ended up going uh, to Boston College uh, for my abroad semester in spring 2017. I went on exchange to George Washington University at Washington, D.C. My favorite memory from the exchange a lot of memories, uh, I, I can't, uh, you know, choose one or two. But um, the favorite memory was that of, of the snow because I went uh, in the spring, uh, spring semester and it was a totally different experience from what I'm experiencing at AUS. So the constant snow, the cold weather, the, the people I've met from all around the world, my Korean roommate, my American roommates, all great memories, great memories about Boston. Yeah. My favorite memory from exchange was just basically traveling around everywhere. I got to go to a lot of states. I went to New York, to Philadelphia, Miami, New Jersey. That was, that was the best part. Like, I got to go around a lot. The one thing I missed the most, um, I would say I, I would miss my roommates because uh, in the US, uh, I don't have any roommates because I live uh, off campus. So I miss my roommates because we, we used to, you know, um, share our moments every single day of the semester. Um, we share the happy moments, sad moments, the troubles. So they were more, more brothers than roommates. So. If I would go back in time, the advice I would give myself is to make wise decisions. My best friend on exchange would be this Italian girl called Silvia. She was also an exchange student from a university in Italy. My craziest memory was we went to a Future concert, you know Future? Uh, Migos, yeah. So um, I was in Washington DC and the concert was in Virginia. That's like a two hour drive. So going there was fine, you know, it was cool. We went, we had a good time. On the way back, Uber is crashing and there's no cars, there's no right. So we literally had to like just try to catch a ride from anyone. It was, it was a crazy night. Um, believe it or not, uh, the moment I've uh, set foot in Boston, I felt like uh, I've been here before. Like I didn't feel any, any, any culture shock. Because you know now with the globalization and you know, uh, traveling around, if I can go back in time, what would I do differently? I would say I would do, th do the, the exact thing I did, except that I wish that I, I studied abroad uh, more, like an additional semester because uh, being abroad, um, you know, it changes you. The one thing that I really miss the most is just the overall vibe you have there. It's so different than here at AUS. Like, you just feel it once you go there. You're free to be whoever you want to be. It's different. Everything is different, so I really miss that.